Oh my gosh, I want you guys to grab a drink. Every time you hear me say the word excited during this video, you're gonna take a sip, and then we're all gonna be riding a party bus by the time it's over. It's gonna be amazing. Hey Diamond Painting friends, Jessica here with Tiny Worlds of Wonder, stopping in to share a video that I really couldn't be more excited about if I tried. I have been waiting to do this video for months. I'm so excited. Ah! Okay, so a couple months back, Robin and I were perusing the interwebs, as we do, looking for art that would make amazing diamond paintings. And this is sometimes how I spend my Saturday nights. Don't judge me. Um, we stumbled across an absolutely phenomenal artist and we thought we just have to sign her. She is amazing. Robin ran her by a couple of other creators and they also agreed she's amazing. So we proceeded to work on that process and it's a process and today's the day <laughs> when I'm going to show you Robin's latest artist collaboration with the beautiful and talented Geneva Bowers. I'm so excited. Okay, let me tell you a little bit about Geneva. So Geneva is a self-taught illustrator. She lives in North Carolina and she says, I love manipulating color and adding whimsy with a touch of realism and calm. And I would say that that is very accurate. If you go over to her website, which of course I'll link in the description below, and you take a peek at her images, I think you will see a couple of things. One, her images do promote this amazing sense of calm, and two, they almost all feature black and brown faces, and that is something that is sorely needed in our diamond painting community. I want to hang on my wall a variety of beautiful faces because beautiful faces come in all shapes, sizes, colors, genders, it's a beautiful spectrum. And I think we want that entire spectrum in our repertoire of artists. Geneva, we are so excited to have you as our latest Distracted by Diamonds artist. As I was prepping for this video today, I was lucky enough to encounter an interview on WUNC that Geneva gave. And one of her goals, as, as she said in the interview, was to increase the representation of black and brown characters in science fiction and fantasy. And I have to say, like, she just came across as the most beautiful, compassionate soul. I'm, I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited about this today. So I have a brand new release here from Distracted by Diamonds. Of course, I bought this with my own money, just like I do all of my Distracted by Diamonds canvases. A little disclaimer up front, of course, I am not affiliated with Distracted by Diamonds on the business side, so I, I am completely uninvolved in the manufacturing, the customer service, any of that, but I do work with them, licensing artists and finding artwork. So that's my role. Robin is a friend, you guys are also friends, so I'm gonna do my best to be as objective as possible when I unbox these canvases, but I think it's important that you know that relationship up front. While I get into this box, I'm gonna tell you a little bit more about Geneva's creds. So Geneva has worked for Netflix, DreamWorks Animation, Wild Brain Studios, Disney Animation. In 2018, she won a Hugo Award for Best Fan Art. In 2018, she was nominated for a BSFA Award. Super cool. And I don't know if any of you guys are into webcomics or have kids or grandkids who are into webcomics, but she also has her own self-published webcomic called Hover Girls. Um, which you can Google online. My daughter's super into web comics, so I'm gonna have to tell her all about it. So you've noticed right away that we have a bit of a difference in my Distracted by Diamonds unboxings from the past, in that this is coming in a beautiful new box. So, very protected, but of course, you saw it was wrapped in cellophane. So, I'm guessing Robin didn't unbox every one of these to stick extras in there. This image, it's called Neon, and this is truly the image that Robin and I flipped out over. <laughs> I'm super excited, super excited. Look at this. 
Look at this. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is gonna be so amazing. <laughs> now, as you can see, we have a dropped legend on one side, a raised legend on the other. Look at the colors in this canvas. Oh my word. And here's another thing I loved about it, you guys. Look at her lips. She has rainbow lips. Which pretty much, which pretty much made my whole day when I saw this image. She's got this beautiful rainbow hair, rainbow lips. This is super cool. I can see this in my daughter Sophia's room all day long. It's incredible. And we have a little skull necklace down here at the bottom. Let me scooch up a tiny bit. How cool is that? That is stunning. And this rendered beautifully. This is a 52 by 56 round drill canvas. And that's pretty small. So if you're looking for a slightly quicker project than some of Robin's canvases, this might be an amazing option for you. I can never get covers back down. Never. I'm not even going to lift the bottom because I'll just mess it up, you know? It looks so pristine and then I just come along and, and mess it up. All right. Have you guys been taking a drink every time I say excited? I hope so. It'll make your life more fun. I mean, if you don't have a drink drink, you could have coffee. And then you'd still be pretty excited by the time the video is over. <laughs> All right. This canvas came with... A new toolkit. Now I know you guys, you're expecting like extra goodies like stickers and a little sample of wax in there. Robin can't stick that in all these sealed canvases. She just can't do that. I think my boat has been eating a little too much popcorn in quarantine and it's having trouble coming out of the bag. I'm having this problem, I know. All right, so we have some blue wax here in a little container, super cool. We've got some tweezers, really nice tweezers. We've got our blue pen with squishy, which fits the blue pen. It really fits. The pen's also been eating the popcorn. <laughs> and then we have a, that's not a three placer. That might be a four placer. And I bet that's like a seven placer. So some nice placers that are gonna be interchangeable in your pen there. And then we have, an inventory sheet. This canvas has 34 colors. And do you see this right here? Round with A, Bs. That's pretty darn exciting. Oh my gosh. Okay. Now, I want to talk to you guys about inventory sheets because I have a personal preference, okay? I don't like inventory sheets, actually. And I think inventory sheets... Back in the day when the only canvases we could get were on AliExpress, you know, with the good old fashioned stolen artwork, and we had to do all that inventory ourselves, and they'd short us drills, and then we'd have to like basically beg on our knees to get those replacement drills. We don't, when we're dealing with companies like Diamond Art Club, Distracted by Diamonds, DIY Moon Shop, we don't have those issues anymore. This is just my opinion on it. I could take or leave these. I actually think unless these look incredibly polished, they might actually take away from the kit a bit. I know this is in process with the manufacturing that these canvases will all have the artist's name on the bottom. I know that that's coming and it's a work in progress right at the moment. And so we won't even need that on our inventory sheet anymore. If I got a canvas without an inventory sheet, what I would do is just use my phone and take a picture of the legend. I can print it if I want to, but otherwise, honestly, I could take or leave those. Tell me how you feel about it, but that's my honest opinion. I think it's just an extra step we don't need. I want to look into the drills. So, crackling's going to ensue. Fair warning. Or I might just speed it up and it'll be like the magic of, of YouTube. Now, of course, I asked Robin if there was anything I should know before I did this video today, and there was something she told me, and, and she said, you might feel sad, but these are gonna come in cellophane baggies rather than pre-bagged, and there's a reason for that. The reason these come in these kinds of baggies is because of this 
right here. Let me see if I can get you close enough. Can you guys see that? Maybe I'll dump these out. Hold tight. Oh my gosh, these are 310 ABs. How exciting is that? <gasps> Robin, I can't believe how far you've taken this so quickly. This is so incredibly exciting to me. So, I'm a little confused. I'm looking at one side. Oh, okay, I see what's happening. So the AB310 is listed on the left side, but it's just listed as 310 on the right side. So that might be something you guys wanna be aware of if you purchase this canvas. I bet it's a misprint on the right side. Um, I mean, it might be deliberate, I don't know. So if you're confused about that, check, check your left-hand legend. It's gonna be the sideways triangle, okay? So that's gonna be... <laughs> Oh, that's so exciting. Okay, I see what this means now. So her glasses are gonna be the ABs, and then the ABs are gonna be sprinkled up into her hair in some of these places, and a little bit down in the halter of her dress, down here. That's gonna be so fun, you guys. Now here's what I didn't realize until I looked at this Closer, there's actually two ABs. There's actually two ABs in this canvas. Okay, let's find them. Let's find them, you guys. Let's do some colors. This is my really high-tech method for resealing my baggies when I don't want to kit them up. I could buy I could buy stock in scotch tape. Because <laughs> I have a lot of scotch tape baggies in my stash. Alright, let's look at the rest of these colors. This canvas is so colorful, there's no way you're gonna be able to see these if I just don't flip it over. So we've got reds, browns, purples. Oh, there it is, I found it. I'll take it out and then we'll look at the rest. Look at this beautiful rainbow of colors. <laughs> every color of the rainbow, and look at this amazing yellow background. Um, I'm just so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, I have to remember, like, I can't pound on the table. I can't punch the person next to me, which is what I usually do when I'm really excited. <laughs> Aren't you glad you're not here in person? <laughs> Magenta, you guys. This is gonna be amazing. How am I gonna keep from starting this right now? I can't start this right now, it's almost drills and chills. Oh, I literally have four canvases in progress right now. I can't start another one. Robin, <laughs> what are you doing to me? Okay, those are, those are gonna be so fun. They're gonna be so fun. And you guys, the other AB, is 666. It's red. Okay, let's look. Let's look. It is the downward arrow. That's gonna go in her hair right here. <laughs> uh, oh, you beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. That's gonna be stunning. Okay, I wanna look at these. I wanna look at these. I feel like a kid in a candy store right now. Ah, this is so amazing. Okay. Now, once again, on the right side, this just says 666. On the left-hand side, it says AB666. So don't let that confuse you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at 666. This is, a, this is amazing. This is going to be amazing. Amazing. I want to do this so bad. Oh my gosh. How am I going to keep from doing this? I want to sit and do it right now. That's a good sign. That's a really good sign. All right, so things to watch for in upcoming releases. And this is something Robin told me. The artist name printed on the canvas. The dual legends, those are gonna hang around. Kits with ABs are gonna have a little bit different drill packaging than the usual pre-bag drills. And then, of course, we have the brand new boxes which protect your canvas in shipping. You guys, 
I'm gonna, I might actually sit and do a couple drills on this. If I do, I'll pop back and show you. Please check out links below to Robin's Etsy shop. She lists every day at noon and between eight and nine Eastern Standard Time. Okay, um, so that's a little tidbit for you if you're stocking the shop looking for canvases. Check out Geneva's website below. Of course, I'll stick a link to that. I'll also stick a link to that WUNC interview where you can just hear Geneva talk and it's so much fun, I think, to get to know the artist whose work you are diamond painting. It's such an amazing connection. I hope you guys have a wonderful week. I hope you're as excited about this new artist as I am. I just can't even contain myself. I'm about to literally burst with excitement. Thanks so much for watching today. Of course, spread some joy wherever you are and I'll catch you next time. Bye.